Hofu ya malala imebuka kutokana na madai kuwa baadhi ya maafisa waliosimamia zoezi hilo tarehe tisa mwezi Agosti wamekuwa na mikutano ya siri na baadhi ya wagombea wenza kwenye kinyang'anyiro hicho wakishirikisha wafanyikazi wakuu wa kaunti ya Kakamega. Mnavyojua kwamba tuko na uchaguzi tarehe tisa mwezi wa nane na ningependa kuambia wale wafuasi wetu kwamba tuko tayari tumejitayarisha vilivyo kwa uchaguzi huo wasiwe na shaka tunahimiza tu watu wetu waende wapige kura tuko na mikakati ya kutosha ya kulinda kura yetu kuna watu ambao wako na dhana kwamba kura yetu inaweza ibiwa ningependa kuambia hakuna kura yetu itaibiwa hata moja tumeweka mikakati katika kila polling station kuhakikisha kwamba ile kura ambayo unaenda kupiga kama mfuasi wangu inaenda kuchungwa vilivyo kuna uh, peers na clerks ambao mheshimiwa Paranya anakutana nao kila wakati. Anakutana nao akiwa convince kwamba waweze iba kura ndi wasaidie yule candidate wake. So peers na clerks ambao mnatumika vibaya. Tutaka tuseme kwamba sisi tutaweka uh, 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 measures kali kabisa hapo kwa polling station. Tutahakikisha kwamba tumeka measures kali hakuna kura yetu itaibiwa na usikue part of that scheme because unaatarisha una maisha yako akizungumza na wanahabari mjini Kakamega Malala amedai kuwa kuna njama ya kuhusisha maafisa hao watume huru ya uchaguzi na uratibu wa mipaka nchini IEBC pamoja na baadhi ya maafisa wa serikali ya kaunti ya Kakamega kushiriki wizi wa kura pesa yetu ya serikali ya kaunti ya Madawa inaporwa ikipeanwa kwa sub county administrators wakikula hata wafikishi wadogo wao hapa chini ward administrators are not being facilitated sub county ad, eh, community administrators hawapewi hiyo pesa ni wale sub county administrators wanapokea hizo pesa na wanakula hizo pesa tungependa kusema kwamba mtu yoyote ambaye ana take part kwa maneno ya ufisadi kwa maneno ya kuchukua pesa za madawa kuja kufanyia siasa we are not going to allow that ningependa wananchi mkipata sub county administrator yoyote ambaye anahusikana na masuala ya kugawa pesa ambaye anashurutisha community administrators kugawa pesa huyo mtu inafaa mshtaki na mshike na hatua itachukuliwa kwake kwa upande wake manager msimamizi wa uchaguzi kaunti ya Kakamega akizungumzia jambo hili amewahakikishia wagombea kuwa zoezi litakuwa la haki na kuongeza kuwa mpangilio mpya wa maafisa watakao shiriki kwenye zoezi hilo utafikiwa is all from both sides that the claims are there lakini kitu mimi na hata ninashanga uh, kwa nini wana meet au peers kwa sababu hakuna pale tumesema hao ndio watakuwa peers uh, uh, on monday hakuna contract kati yetu na wale walifanya kazi tarakisha kama peers kwa peers again on 29 I can assure you there will be so many changes. Yeah, the people that uh, they think they were peers may find themselves not peers at all. They may find themselves not not working at all. Hata wale wale kwa class, some of them watajipata kama peers because all of them are trained. Yeah, so we we'll just do the fresh training for all of them and they know what they are doing. And we are going to see the best way to handle the issues of the PO. But what I can assure you is uh, uh, those who are POs on 9th may not be POs on 29th. You may find those who are DPOs uh, promoted to be POs, maybe some clerks promoted to POs, Ibu Ibu too. So meeting the POs who are there on 9th is a waste of time and money. Edwin Wanyama Mwale Waimani